I know Kim and uh, Leah really appreciate it. Um, you know, I wanted to say, uh, you know, I appreciate my daughter and, uh, and uh, you know, I'm really happy that uh, this, uh, this day has come. And uh, I know she worked very hard. I know uh, Leah, I know we all, we all spent a lot of weekends uh, going back and forth to tournaments, uh, a lot of games in the summer. A lot of practices from the age, you know, 10 on up. So I, uh, I want to say that uh, I'm very proud of my daughter. I, uh, I think, uh, I think the world of her, and uh, I want her to come over here and give me a hug. <laughs> I'd like to invite her coaches to say a couple words. Uh, Greg uh, Rich, her uh, coach uh, from summer, has uh, volunteered to say a few words, and I'd like uh, Paul to say a couple words, too. Thanks, Greg. Well, I uh, want to congratulate Lee also. Thank you. I watched her grow up with Madison in this class, so congratulations. And uh, uh, not prepared to say anything, so we're going to test my impromptu skills. Last week I had a Whole sheet this long, but uh, I agree. What an accomplishment for Kim and her family! Uh, a lot of hard work, as you all know, being sports people. Uh, the time on the road, the sacrifices. And I'll just share a quick story with Kim. Uh, Kim played for the Lookouts one year when she came to the tryout. But to be honest, um, I kind of had another girl in mind that was trying out. But after Kim tried out, I said, "Wow, what an athlete!" And if I were to describe Kim overall, she's a heck of an athlete. Uh, from from playing softball, running bases, she runs like a deer. Uh, she, in the shortstop hole, she can go backhand, she can go forehand, she can play that six hole. She'll make catches over her shoulder about anywhere you think that on the left side of the infield, she can catch that ball. And then hitting hitting the ball, uh, she had a good year, her junior year at the plate in, in high school and always getting better there. But uh, I remember Colorado, she, she was just on fire. And uh, no matter who hit the ball, where it was hit, um, she was able to make that play. So it was, a, it was a privilege for me and my family to coach and work to get to know Kim. And I think on the uh, personal side, establishing that relationship was pretty special. So I'd also like to congratulate the Bride Focals and Kim. And I, I dusted up the old park jersey. That I had an older daughter play there. And, of course, when, they were, when she played there, they weren't winning then. So, Coach, good luck. And, uh, <laughs> you went to Nationals last year. Yeah, you're four, so good luck at Park. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you did in uh, helping build Kim. We really, really think that was a, a pivotal step to uh, to uh, the success that she's had since. So. My pleasure. Well, I would too would, uh, I guess, like to congratulate both athletes for their accomplishments. Uh, without a doubt, uh, as Greg said, th there's no doubt about it, her, Kim's uh, best attribute is her athleticism. Uh, when she played shortstop for us, which, you know, she moved in uh, as a sophomore into the starting lineup and held that position down for three years. Um, so uh, she did a, did a great job. Her range was uh, just tremendous. And I, I'm not sure that Greg mentioned it, or maybe he did and I didn't hear it, but what an arm. She's got a rocket for an arm and uh, just a, a tremendous athlete. Uh, he said ran the base as well. She's a great uh, base dealer and and uh, very instinctive base runner. Uh, so uh, Park is uh, in for a treat with her. I think Coach is going to be looking forward to uh, being able to use her athleticism and it's exciting for me in that uh, she's close by and get a chance to follow her progress real easy. So congratulations, Kim. Uh, we appreciate your efforts and the work you put in. So great job. Thanks so much, Robert.